Welcome back to our channel. Oh. Welcome back to our channel. I'm Michael Citron and I run the top selling real estate team here in Parkland and we're top selling realtors here in South Florida. If you find any value in this video at all, I only ask that you please hit the like button. And if you really like the video, please subscribe so you can be notified when we post new content and support our channel on a weekly basis. If you would like to book a call with me or a team member, you can easily do so by going to the first link in the description below and easily book a buyer call, seller call, or just a discovery call to chat about the market. We're here for you. This week, I'm going to discuss the three ways to tap into your home equity in order to become the most powerful buyer in today's market than ever before. Then we will dive deep into the Parkland real estate numbers in order to see the sales and the mortgage rates and what you need to know as a homeowner. Finally, we will discuss our upcoming Elevate Parkland event, which is just a little under a month away, and we already have over 100 registered attendees. Before I dive in, I want to first thank you for watching. If you like anything I discuss, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. So maximize your $300,000 home equity. These are the three strategies to use when you're able to conquer the 7% interest market that is going up. So rates are going up. Home equity is the money that you pay off on your mortgage and own outright. If it is the difference between what your home is worth and how much is still owed on your mortgage. Let's face it. If you purchased a home 10 or even just two years ago, you have developed hundreds of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of dollars in home equity. In fact, according to CoreLogic, the average U.S. homeowner now has approximately $290,000 in equity. So we have just under $300,000 in equity. Two years, this market went up by 40, 50, up to 60% in some cities across the, the nation. And people are sitting on this home equity, but they have to either refinance and take on a big rate or sell their property and cash out of the, of the home in order to tap into this money. So it's not there as a bank that you can just get out. So as you can see in the following pie graph, 68.7% have paid off their mortgage and are sitting on at least 50% of equity in their homes across the nation. So understand, people have a lot of equity and a lot of people even own their properties outright, as you can see in this pie chart. So what are the three ways that you can get ahead of the market with all of this equity that you have in your property? Well, number one, be an all cash buyer. We always say cash is king. Get the best deals on properties. Negotiate them. You don't have a, a mortgage. You don't have, and then you know, uh, uh, you know, you're telling the seller that you're they're not going to have a mortgage process. You're not going to have to get the house appraised. You know, it's it's a much easier experience for a seller to deal with a cash buyer right now. So if you developed a lot of equity in your home, you can sell and use all of your equity or most of it to either pay all cash or get a small loan where the monthly mortgage payment would be significantly less. And then, you know, obviously you can refinance that in the next couple of years or sooner. Number two, make a larger down payment. Your equity could be used to put a larger deposit down on your next home purchase. According to Experian, increasing your down payment lowers your principal loan amount and consequently your loan to value ratio, which could lead to a lower interest rate uh, offer from your lender. So banks are looking to lend still. If you can put a lot of money down, they're going to give you a better loan, even at a better interest rate. And you're going to be able to take a lot of that equity and put a lot of it down. So your, your payment is not as crazy from what you currently have to what you are buying if you're upsizing or downsizing. And again, you're going to refinance in the next five years. So that loan program could be even more advantageous with a larger down payment. And number three, which people are not even thinking about, all of this equity has been developed in the last couple years. You're sitting on a gold mine of equity in your property, and you really only got it in the last two or three years after COVID. So avoid the capital gains tax when selling. If you sell your home, you can avoid paying capital gains tax to Uncle Sam. As a single person, you will not have to pay up to $250,000 in net gains. As a married couple, you won't have to pay up to $500,000 in capital gains taxes. This could save you 15 to 20% of gains that you keep in your pocket. So understand right now, take advantage of that equity. Cash is king and use it wisely. 
Right now, you can be a much more powerful buyer. You can get the home of your dreams. You have all this equity that you can purchase if you're upsizing or downsizing. And it really is the time to get off the fence and look into this because you're, if the market changes, whatever, you cannot take that money out. It's, it's gone. It's like a stock. Once the market changes, that money goes away and you will have less equity in the property, which you can tap into. So please, we're here to help you. So this week in real estate for Parkland, Florida, we have under 100 homes. Again, we're down to 97 single family homes for sale. That's excluding the 55 plus communities and condos and townhouses. Among those homes, 37 price reductions. So we already have 38% of those 97 homes have already been reduced in price by one time, if not more. And those homes have been sitting on the market on average for 68 days. Our list is, our prices that we're getting for our homes are getting them under contract in 22 days. You know, so we're the exception right now. And I, I look at these numbers, they're being very consistent and they're rising. The days on market is rising. So if you have a house to sell and you're one of those 97, you know, sellers and it's not working out and your listing expires afterwards, give us a call. I mean, it, it is really changing. The median sales price, very steady, $1,175,000 right now. And that's sticking around. We saw that um, year over year prices have gone up about 4% overall in Parkland, but we're starting to see that market really, really stabilize, especially with interest rates. In the past seven days alone, 10 new listings on the market, single family, 12 price reductions, 11 homes went under contract, and 10 homes sold. The um, 38 available single family homes for rent with 44 days average on the market. So understand, we have a lot of rentals on the market right now. Uh, every week I see it ticking back up closer to 40 rentals. And the summer is when a lot of these rentals move. So if we get to that 40 or 50 mark, half of the homes, it's like you got 100 homes and you got 50 that it could be renting. You know, so we're starting to see a change. So in 2022, year to date, the median, uh, you know, the median rental price price year to date in 2022 was 5750 in 2023 year to date we've gone up to 5975 so just under that $6000 mark that's a 4% increase so understand values of home single family prices have gone up they're not going up 20 or 30% but they're still steadily going up 4 and 5% for both rentals and single family uh, sales so the mortgage interest rates um, have jumped to 23 year highs should scare you. I mean, obviously, this is why you need to tap into your, your equity. Uh, according to Mortgage News Daily, the 30-year rate, we're at just under 7.4%. 15-year rate at 6.71%. And our 30-year jumbo is at 7.39%. So we're working with lenders that are helping get those rates down for you, you know, either permanently with a buy-down temporarily. Um, so you can then take advantage of refinancing. So you got to be creative in this market, take advantage of knowledge, it's power. And we're able to help you uh, ascertain all this information so you can become a more informed buyer in this market and an informed seller if you need to sell before you buy. So these are great things to look at. And I think it's starting to, you know, be where you really need to know this knowledge if you're selling or not, or you need this equity or what's going to happen in the future. So really understand these are questions you should be asking to the, your real estate uh, expert, um, as well as your financial advisor and your accountant, because these are things that could save you tens, if not hundreds of thousands of dollars. So we're super excited. Um, we thought it was great timing to have our Elevate Parkland event. That is uh, coming up in less than a month, uh, October 19th. Uh, from 5.30 to 8.30, please go to elevateparkland.com. Right now, we have 107 registered um, attendees. We have great speakers such as Rich Walker, uh, Parkland Mayor. We have former Parkland Mayor and current um, Broward County Commissioner, Michael Udine, uh, speaking, as well as Marty Keir, and we will have more guests that we will post. So we are super, super excited. It's going to be very informative. Please register, learn more. Uh, we are going to uh, have uh, you know some more marketing uh, for the event. Uh, we interviewed Lori Aladef, which is posted. Uh, great leader. We're going to bring on Rich Walker, and hopefully we'll get Marty in, in the studio to do a little bit of uh, interviewing so we can have uh, some information to show to you of what these events uh, this event's going to um, 
you know, really bring to the city and a lot of good topics to discuss. So I hope everyone enjoys this. We do this every week. Please like, share, um, you know, we appreciate people's, uh, you know, looking at our events and coming to and supporting our, our team and what we're doing here in Parkland. We like to give back. We're going to have charity opportunities coming up soon. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, we do have one open house this weekend um, in uh, we have it in the landings, our new listing for just uh, under $1.25 million. Beautiful house, uh, upgraded turnkey, so all the information is on our social. And I hope everyone has a great weekend. Happy holidays to, to people that celebrate. Um, and I hope everyone has a, a great weekend. And uh, please check out our open houses. And I look forward to seeing you guys next week for another market update uh, here in the city of Parkland. Thank you so much for watching.